Hey everyone, welcome to the shop. And today I would like to talk about with you. How do I tell if my CO2 tank is empty? It's a question we get a lot around here. So let's look at the pressure regulator because this is obviously how we're going to tell that the tank is empty, right? So this is where the tank screws in. Here is the gauge that determines or that reads how much uh, pressure is in the tank. Here is our output. So this is the the gauge, or here's the the output of the regulator, and here is what's called the working pressure. So tank, tank pressure working pressure. So crisscross. All right, so how do we tell how much gas is left in our imaginary tank? Well, we don't. Not with that. Actually, the way we tell how much gas is left is with a scale. How about that? So here's the reason why this doesn't help us much. Temperature has a lot to do with how much pressure is going to be put on this gauge. If you store your tank in the kegerator or on a hot in a hot garage, this gauge is going to react. It's going to show different pressure for the same amount of gas, depending on the temperature that you keep your tank. So this guy right here doesn't tell us much. So how do we solve this mystery? Well, right there. So here's our tank. We have a scale. What we need to know is our tear weight of our tank. Tear weight is how much this tank weighs empty. And then we just do a little math. So 4.7, so this is in pounds, TW. So look on your tank for TW and then a number. This happens to be a two and a half pound cylinder. But this guy, empty, weighs 4.7. So you take your scale, Take your tank, put them together, subtract the tear weight of 4.7 pounds, and that will tell you how much gas you have left. So there you go. If you have any questions, of course, reach out, comments below, um, or you can ask Jorge the Agave uh, for help. So either one, we're here. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day.